Okay, so this is a Dell Optiplex 7010. Uh, right now this has Windows 10 on it. It's almost a brand new installation. It's about one day old. It has 8 gig of RAM and has a 300 gig mechanical hard drive in it. And right here I have this cheap SSD. This is a 500 gig A data SSD and I just cloned the mechanical drive onto this drive. So I'm just going to time how long it takes to do a full restart on this machine with the mechanical drive and then compare it to the solid state drive so we can see the difference uh, that the solid state drive makes in performance. So I'm going to set up my phone here to be a timer. It is reset and what I'm going to do here is click the start button and then I'm going to hit restart. This still has fast uh, boot up and shut down so basically it puts it to sleep when you go to shut down so instead of sleeping I'm going to do a full restart uh, which I think is a better indication of how long it'll take to do that with the mechanical drive or comparing it to the SSD so I'm going to click restart here and then click start on the phone and then uh, we'll time how long that takes and then do the same thing with the SSD here we go There's 10 seconds so far. This machine actually really runs pretty well with that 300 gig mechanical drive in there. But that drive is probably at least five or six years old now. So if I want something that's a little more reliable, I should probably switch to a newer SSD. Although you never know, this drive could run for a long time. So we're up to 40 seconds. I'm going to time it until we see the wallpaper. Of course, it may not be fully usable once I see the wallpaper, but that's the best indication that I can, or the, the best stopping point that I can use right now. Please wait. Should see the login screen first and then we'll see the wallpaper. And it does automatically log in. There's a minute 30 and this is the login screen here. minute 45 is it going to take a full two minutes? nope about a minute 56 okay so we'll stop it there and then I'm going to swap in the SSD and we'll do the same test okay now I've got the same computer with the SSD connected you can see the SSD is connected right there and Windows is fully booted so we're going to do the same test here and see how long it takes to fully restart this computer with the SSD let's go back into timer I'm sorry stopwatch I'm going to reset the stopwatch we'll do the same thing I did before so I'm going to come down here to the power button and click restart and then I'll click with my finger which takes about a second and here we go So with the mechanical drive in here, it took about a minute 55. With the SSD, I expect this to be much, much quicker. <laughs> Login screen, and there it is. So that was about 23 seconds. That's a whole lot faster.